All right, so Google just released a very interesting experiment called Mixboard. And I think the simplest way to describe this tool is the combination between mood boards and artificial intelligence, especially Gemini's Nano Banana. And that's because you can easily create some unique visuals from a text description. And this is great for getting some inspiration or perhaps you want to branch from some ideas that later you could incorporate into your own project. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can access and use this Mixboard tool from Google and perhaps a few things that you need to know. So first of all, this tool is still in beta. It is not quite stable and also it is only available if you are in the US. If you're not in the US, then you can use a VPN service and you can connect your network to the USA and then you can go to Google, search for Google Mixboard that's just the easiest way to get this tool and then click Mixboard from Google Apps. Now click Get Started. And I guess I have to apologize in advance that my network is kind of slow because I'm using VPN, but yeah, that, that, that could happen. So some errors could happen along the way, mostly because of my slow internet connection. But anyway, I'm going to start a new project. And here, I guess I'm going to get some minimalist bathroom inspiration. So let me type minimalist bathroom. Let's send the message and just wait for AI to generate some pictures. Okay, so these pictures are still being generated. And by the way, if you encounter some error messages, I do recommend to start refreshing the page and that usually will solve some problems. Okay, so here, I guess I have to zoom out a little bit. You can press the control or command key on the keyboard and you can scroll down to zoom out and I'll scroll up to zoom in. So that's one way to control the zoom level of the mood board. Now I'm going to arrange them together so they're going to be a lot easier to organize later. And by the way, if there is any picture that you don't like or you don't want to use in this mood board project, then you can actually delete them. So let me show you how you can delete a picture. Okay, let's say I don't like this picture. I can click it and I can press the backspace or delete key on my keyboard and that will just remove the item. Now, let me just do some cleaning and I want to remove a few things that I'm not going to use. Okay, let's try this one. And okay, I think that's it. Now, uh, basically here, I want to combine some elements into one photo but let me show you a few things that you can do with this mix board especially on each of these individual items so if you click on any of these images you have several different options you can download you can also just duplicate the item and you can also just remove the background so if there is a prominent subject in the photo and you want to focus on the subject and you don't want to have anything else then you can click this button to remove the background and you'll get a transparent picture and also you can get something that look like this and let's say you, you really like this picture and you want to uh, get a slightly di from different angle or different style then you can click this button to get something that look like this and you can also click this button to, re to regenerate this picture again now other than that you can also insert some text if you want to add some description you can do that there is also the option to upload a picture into this project so that's a possibility and i think that's very very useful now let's say i want to create a room design combining this and perhaps combining this these two look amazing now how do you select these two pictures well there are two options you can just do a uh, drag and drop like this, do this like using the cursor. You can also press, sorry, yeah, press the shift key on the keyboard and then click on any item that you want to select together. Now, I'm going to tell this AI to create a room from these elements. Let's send the message and just wait for the result. All right, so I finally got a picture. I actually have to refresh the page a couple times because of the error message. But anyway, we got the result. So this is the picture. Let me just increase the size. So let me just clean everything 
and just I just want to show you the combination between these two photo into this so this this and then this it looks wonderful all the elements are present in the new picture so that's just the basic on how you can use the mix board tool from google of course there are many other things that you can do like you can use it to create some poster design or perhaps you want to use it for marketing or maybe some uh, an inspiration maybe cloth dress etc there are so many different ideas and i cannot uh provide every single example in this video but you can start using the mix board and use this tool to make your life a lot easier so that's basically how you can access and use the mix board tool from google and also a few things that you need to know about this tool and i'm hoping that when you're watching this video in the future perhaps this feature is, is going to be available globally so you don't have to use a vpn service anymore so that's basically it thank you so much for watching and i wish you a great day ahead